Previously, we started the job with the new shell instance. We know how to send an input to that job with chance send function. So when we put ls, it prints a list of files and folders. pwd will print the current working directory. Instead of hard coding the shell command, we can make use of the prompt buffer to get the input from the buffer. Function callback receives the input as the argument, so we want to send that to the shell job. We have to make the job ID global to be able to access it. And instead of the PWD, we want to send the input. Now when we run it, it echoes the result of the shell command. Instead of echoing out the results, let's put it back in a prompt, just like in a normal terminal. We can use the append function and add the result one line above the last line. And here we can pass in it data directly because the append function accepts both a string and list. Now when we run it, the result of the show command gets added right below the prompt.